painted number one? Yes. Uh, came on, my wife wasn't home, her driver's license still in there, the rental car was gone, and her daughter's here, and we were kind of worried about what's happening and where she's at. I was wondering if you could send somebody over here. Okay. Does she have any medical issues? Does she have like Alzheimer's or something like that? Uh, no, no. She's uh, 59 years old. No, she has no medical issues or something like that. And according to her daughter who went up and uh, her purse is still here with her driver's license. The only thing is the phone is gone, and she sent her daughter a text about two hours ago saying they won't let me go. Whatever that means, we don't know. And I've been gone all day parking cars for the football game, and, all, and that's what? where we're at. Daughter a text message saying that they my won't, stepdaughter stepdaughter that they won't let her go. Yeah, they got she got a text message saying that. And it come from her number, right? What what is um what's your name, sir? Steve Collier. Say your last name for me. C O L L I E R. And your wife's name? Deb Deborah Debor. Uh, we call it Debbie, but it's D E B O R R A H. Same last name? Collier, yes. How old is she? Is that 59? 59. She just turned 59. You just this returned year. home, right? Pardon me? You just returned home, right? Yes, I just returned home. I was parking cars uh, until about 4.30, and when I came back, the, the van that she had rented because the car was in the shop uh, was gone. I figured she was shopping for food. Okay. So, you, so, and her car is there. Pardon me. Her 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 van's not here. Okay. But her driver's license and what else is there? Right. Her phone? Yeah. Her driver's license is here. What else did she leave? With a purse or anything else? Uh, yeah. She left her purse and her credit cards are here. When was, when was the last time um, she was seen? Uh, well, I left at 9 o'clock. She was still sleeping. So, last night. I mean, so she was went to bed last night, and your I left, and the van was here. So, is your stepdaughter there, though? I mean, did she, did she see her today? Pardon me? Did your stepdaughter see her today? Pardon me? Wait a minute. You say a stepdaughter. Did she see her or? Say that again. I'm trying to control a dog. Okay. Your, your stepdaughter, did she see her? Um, no, no. Nobody has seen her. Uh, I was probably the last person to see her last night. What time? You said 9 o'clock last night? Yeah, by 9 o'clock we went to bed. What time was the message sent to your stepdaughter? Uh, what, what time? About two hours ago? <clears throat> so about two hours ago? Yes. And it specifically said they won't let me go. Part, yeah, that's what the message said. And is that that's all it said, right? That's all it said. And she was last seen driving, or she was driving her. What kind of car is that? It's uh, I don't know because her car's in the shop. So uh, uh, the rental place on uh, the van that she was driving is that what she be in, or you don't know? No, I don't know. It's uh, Enterprise. She went a car for Enterprise. It's a Pacifica or something. That's the car you saw this morning, though, right? Yeah, the black van. Yeah. It's a black Pacifica. Yes, I'm pretty sure it's Pacifica. And that's a rental car? Yes, from Enterprise. All right, I'm sorry. Um, <clears throat> what's her uh, What's her birth name? Deborah, D-E-B-B-I-E, -E, or oh, her, her given her name is Deborah. D-E-B-O-R-R-A-H. Her birthday? And she white, female, black, female? Pardon me? She white or black? White. 
How tall is she? Uh, about five five. How much do you weigh? About one hundred and fifty. One forty five somewhere around there. What color hair? Uh, blondish. Would she be going to somebody's house or? That's a good question. I thought she was out shopping for food. Her daughter came over with that strange message and then went upstairs to her bedroom and found out that uh, uh, her driver's license and credit card still here. So that doesn't sound like her leaving the house uh, to go shopping like I thought she was. She usually shops for food on Saturday. So she don't have any money at all with her or any other car? To Not to our knowledge. She has nothing. But she, is a purse there? Yes. She left the purse as well? Yes. Does she have family here in town? No, just her daughter. Have you tried to call the hospitals and jails to be sure? Uh, no, I didn't think of calling the hospital. Okay. Go ahead. Like I said, I got them on the way out there to you. Okay. Go ahead, okay. Go ahead, go ahead and call both hospitals, Athens okay. Regional and St. Mary's, and, and just check with okay. the jail as well to make sure. Um, and we'll have somebody come out there and talk to you. Okay. Um, Athens Court, can you please? Hi, can I speak with Colonel Johnson? Okay, I don't have a Colonel Johnson. Okay. Um, he he just called me. Um, I I just I had some more information for him, and I I just I wanted to get it to him. Um, my name's Amanda Bearden. Okay. Okay. All right. Hold on one second. I talked to you earlier, so uh, it was uh, yes. Sergeant Johnson. We had you talk to. Hold on. Sergeant Johnson. I'm okay. sorry. Honey. No, that's okay. Um, there's lots of Johnsons around here, so I don't want to make sure I got the right one. I get it. <laughs> um, you just need him to call you back. Uh, yes, ma'am. I, I just I thought about it, and I have her iCloud information. I, I know that it, it's a, and correct me if I'm wrong, but if the phone is turned off, it would still track her. Um, but I, I do have her. I've got her Apple ID and what I thought was her password, but the password isn't working. I, I don't know if y'all have technology or whatever, but I, I do have. I, I I don't know. I'm just. I mean, you know. I, all right, hold on one second, okay? Thank you. Okay, thank you. All right, ma'am, he said he'd be calling you back shortly, okay? Thank you so much. All right, no problem. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Sorry, Kenny, please. Yes, sir. Uh, my name is Diane Shirley, and my sister uh, lives in Georgia, and my niece told me she was missing. Her name is Deborah Collier, or she could go by Debbie. Okay. And, and I'm wondering if y'all have any information about it. <clears throat> as far as, I mean, no, no, not other than with the officer or whoever is working on the case, I, I don't know anything Um where was she, where did she live? Do you know? Um, all I know is, I'm sorry, I don't know her, her her address. Collier. Okay. C O S I E R. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't have any information. Um, you know, when there's something, they will they will contact the family. Um, whenever they like I said, whenever they have something for that. Okay. All right. We're just not getting information, so I'm, I'm just. Yeah, I'm sorry just, about I'm that. Just, I am really worried about my sister. Okay. And. You know, she. Do you have any information where she might go, or you have anything to add? Well, to my, from from my niece, she said that mm. she was in an accident about a month ago, and she was, you know, on the road. She was following this truck, and this truck lost a paint can. And the paint can hit my sister's car, and the paint went everywhere. And the driver was trying to convince my sister not to tell the cops that he was driving because he was out on parole, and there was, you know, a stipulation to his parole that he couldn't drive. 
I got you. Do you, think, I, that, do you think that was? My, I'm sorry. I was going to ask. Do you think that was told to anybody else? Well, uh, do you think that was told to uh, the officer that, that concern? That standing from my niece. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if the officer knows that, but I can have him call you um, if you want to pass it along with really, him, anything to help, you know. Yes, I would really appreciate that. Yeah, that's no problem. Because I'm in Alabama. I'm sorry, go ahead. I, I'm in Alabama, and, you know, I, I, I'm really too, she won't, you know, she's not communicating very well with us, and I really would like to know what's going on. I got you. Yeah, since you, I mean, since you may have insight on that, let me, I'll have the sergeant give you a call. Is that okay? Yes, sir. That would be wonderful. 